Hey guys, Fabulik here today and welcome back to Prison Architect. Uh, this time we're going to continue, you know, the usual, the prison, you're going to keep going on. I do want to do like the classroom and all that kind of stuff as well, so let's see if we can get that in. Now, interestingly, there's some comments from the last video saying that selling shares gives away the profit, like the cash flow, but then I don't see where that, it doesn't say that anywhere. It says that when we sell our prison, we'll only get 250000 because that's half the value of my prison. So it says that, but I don't see anywhere where it says anything about cash flow, though there seems to be a few people that say that that's the case. So anyway, what I'm going to do, I'm going to buy back some of my shares there anyway, so that uses actually quite a lot of money. But we do now, because we've been doing this bank loan, um, we do have a high enough credit rating that we can increase our loan quite a bit. And I'm actually just going to try it out and see if we can do enough of this to get back enough of our, uh, not, not that, enough of our prison, wait, Oh, these tabs, I mean, I don't wear it here. Buy my shares, buy my shares. And then the next one is 39,000, which can get another one. So now we own 90% of our prison. The thing is that we now have a big, uh, big loan. So there is that. There is that, but we can still take out more of a loan. It's only 5,000 a day. Uh, so we might as well just get back all of our, our shares, because you guys were saying that the loan is way, way better than the, the shares. So it's like, we might as well do that. So we need another 39,000. Let's just get more of a... Oh, that was too much of a loan, but that'll do. Because we'll use it anyway. Because I actually want to do stuff, so let's have a look. Right, so I own all of my prison. Uh, my cash flow has dropped, but that's because I'm now paying back a bank loan as well. So I think there's that, but I don't know. It doesn't say it here, though. Where... Can I... Oh, here. I was say, can I see um, what we're actually spending money on here? So reform programs, loan interest is 8900 And then we've got all this stuff in here. Okay, is there anything we can actually cut back on? Let's see, staff food, 2200, prisoner, <laughs> prisoner food, wait, what? Are we not spending like any money on their food? I guess not, hang on, policy. Oh yes, yeah, low and low. <laughs> yeah, we already did that, fair enough. Fair enough, you know, we'll leave it. I think they're fine. So, we've got a little bit of money, so let's see what we can do with that. Let's have a pause real quick. So we need to do the classroom. If we actually complete, well, no, we're not going to complete that, are we? If we complete this, though, a lot of you guys also were saying we should start doing dormitories. I, I just have never really liked them because the prisoners get more upset about dormitories. Uh, so I don't know about that. But I think what we might do, maybe we'll intake some more criminally insane. Because like you guys are saying, they do, they do give us a lot more money. And I think maybe we'll build them in here, even though it's kind of like right near the edge. And we've, we've got all these, we've got all these problems. There's a lot of problems in this prison. But the thing is, the other thing we can do is once this, I mean, we could actually do it now if we want to. I don't want to because I want to keep working this one. But if we sell our prison, um, let's say the sale price is 290 and then we get, we get all of that, I guess because of my loan, if I paid back the, yeah, if I paid back the loan, we get a lot more. But anyway, then you'd start with that money on a brand new prison. So you could do a lot more. So that's kind of how you can sort of start off with more money. But anyway, so we're not going to do that right now because I don't want to. Uh, I guess I'll resume the game. It doesn't need to be paused. I want to plan out another cell block here because I think if we get another big intake of these guys, it could be quite good. So we've got 12 by 16. How big is this area? That's 14 wide. Uh, so if we did 12 by 16, we could get the same size block there, which I don't want to do because that's weird. Uh, we probably want to, well, I want to fix this cell block because I, I, we did this because we wanted it to be in line and have a hallway. We don't really need it to be like that anymore. So if we expanded that out to here, here and go up like that, okay. And then we can actually fit a hallway here. So we actually just extend this building so it now joins here. We could probably put this inside. It doesn't need to be outside. Then this could be a hallway as well that goes straight up there. Actually, does, how big is this area? That is, well, that is 16, so we could actually do it sideways. The thing is, we we kind of just need to level stuff and just redo it, because it's just, it's all over the place, quite frankly. Um, also, you guys were saying, because um, I, I think I was asking about the uh, uh, the cloning tool last time. Apparently, I don't, I don't know, because we were trying to figure out how it works. It's like, it charges you for planning, and then it charges you for object. I don't know, it's kind of confusing. So I'm just going to go back to manually building stuff. I don't know what's going on with these walls, but um, that's fine. So I'm going to go here, we're going to go classy green, because apparently that's what we do. Alright, so we build that little section there. Then we're going to want to build out this area, and then I'm going to want to build this area. So we'll see how we go. Oh, and there's also a comment saying that if we make everything priority, nothing's priority. But that's not necessarily true, because if I'm just saying do all this, and like how I was saying do all this area, it means, because there's a lot of other little jobs that the, the, the workmen do, like they come down here, they do all the trees down here, they're sort of moving stuff back and forth as well. So if we tell them like this is what we want them to do in this area, they'll make sure they do that first. 
um, above any other thing because they have other jobs to do as well so it's just nice sometimes to be like i want you to work in this area first especially because it's nighttime they're all locked away it's going to be best to do it now um oh we should actually probably do a shakedown it's kind of, kind of been a while since we've properly done that now we're not making a whole bunch of money but I think if we build out this area and just intake a bunch of prisoners, we'll get a bunch of money. We're going to get 6,000 tomorrow as well, which is nice. And then we'll up that when we, well, when we get some of these guys coming in, it'll be quite nice. I think at the moment, what is actually, oh, we've broken his walls. That's actually not a cell right now. Uh, so what is our capacity for these guys right now? Because we, we always want to have a bit of spare space just in case. Because we've got 24 criminally insane and we have a 29 capacity, which is good. So there's a few extra cells. So this guy will probably be moved to another one in the meantime. Um, all right, that looks good, except for this big breach in the wall here that they can just get out of. So let's put that wall back to there. And then we're going to build a wall here as well that goes up. And then we'll build this one down. And then I'm also going to build over that perimeter wall. And I'm going to tell them to do that first above anything else. We're finding a bunch of stuff. I'm pretty sure there's people tunneling down here too. Um, oh yeah, you guys are also telling me that I should be using uh, like some of the footbridges, but I wasn't quite sure how I was going to use these because I was hoping we could like bridge over the walls, but that doesn't seem to work. Or even bridge over like just this wall here, for example. Uh, or like this to give shortcuts for staff is what you guys are saying. Like I know it works over roads, so it's really good for that if we were to have a wall. Although actually having said that, how would that work over a road? Because if it doesn't go over a fence, what's the point of having a footbridge? Because that means I can't really cross... I don't... You know what? I don't understand how you're supposed to use this. So you get a footbridge, which is cool, so they can walk over the road. But how do you keep it in a secure area? Because you can't have a fence under it, can you? Unless you build it first and then put a fence under it? Maybe we need to experiment with those, but maybe not right now. Like, maybe when we have money. <laughs> I don't know. I don't know. Yeah, because I, I would like to use those. Uh, we have a lake here. I, I guess maybe, did you guys mean like here? Like, we, I guess, I don't know how this would help, but it doesn't even reach. It's too, too far. I don't know. Anyway, it would be nice to use those. Uh, I also found out there's other random items in here that I've not seen. Add a flipboard with brain chart to the psych uh, psychiatrist's office and it will improve psychiatrist treatment. Like, why are these not items that the game tells me about? Which is a psychiatrist's office? Uh, is this psychiatrist? A psychologist. I think that's psychologist. This is a psychiatrist. Uh, so we've got a lot of stuff in this room. There's not, actually not that much room. So I'm going to say this can go over here. And then there's also like, there's all this other stuff too. Yeah, there's like, I don't know. How much is it improving the room by though? Because like we could do all of these things. Anatomy model. Huh. I can fit it in there. I can't fit there. And there's like these things. It's like we've got medicine cabinets as well. There you go. I'll give you one of those. Give you one of these. This guy's got lots of medicine cabinets. And then you can have a sweet anatomy model too. Look at that. Yeah. I don't know. Anyway, that's fine. All right. So, okay. That's looking pretty good. They nearly done that wall over there. Let's just speed up time here a little bit. Still doing a shakedown. Did we find anything down here? I don't know. It's probably fine at the moment. Uh, yeah, these guys have a lot of stuff, but that's fine. Oh, hello. Hello, hello. Are you a snitch? Yep, being a snitch. Yeah, we should probably get on protective custody. Maybe we'll see if we can do that today. Let me firstly get this section built. I want to do this first because it'd be actually quite nice. Now let's also go here. Walls and doors. We're going to remove, well not walls and doors, rooms. Uh, if I, what am I doing? Rooms. Get rid of this. I'm going to clear out this area. We're going to, I guess we're going to have to dismantle this stuff because otherwise I don't see an easier way of moving it. I mean, I could double click it all, but that seems like it's going to be way harder. So let's just dismantle all these items one by one. And all that. And then these drains, all gone. And then we're going to reconfigure this back to going the same way as the other cell blocks, just so we're back to the same way. Oh, uh, okay. Well, there's also a big hole in the wall right there, <laughs> which is probably not ideal. <laughs> uh, okay, let's uh, let's get that back, please. Um, hang on. Is this all still... Uh, yeah, it's medium security. Okay, that should be medium, but... I'll set it as medium now, so there's not going to be any criminally insane going through. <laughs> All right, then that's insane sec. Okay, cool. All right, so that's better. So this guy's now stuck in there. That's fine. Uh, well, it's not fine. It's okay, but it's not ideal. Uh, I'm going to just move this door to... Is that the middle? I think so, to there. And then we're going to dismantle this one. And that should be fine. And then we can sort of clear out all this space. I, I actually really, really enjoy it. And I'm glad, because I've seen comments about it as well. Like, I really enjoy 
reconfiguring spaces and rebuilding stuff, I think it's really, it's fun. It's a fun little challenge to sort of work around our existing prison and reconfiguring it. I don't know, I find it really fun, because then you get more things that are a little bit more pokey, maybe don't make the most sense. Of real, this is clearly, very clearly not an efficient prison. But, you know, we're having fun with it. Um, what am I doing with this space? Should we turn that into more cells? Because I know it's a staff area, or was I going to do that as something else? Because I don't know... I don't think I decided what it was going to be last time either. But, eh, I guess for now. I'll leave it for now. Um... Oh yeah, someone's like, the dog ball in here was annoying them. It's like, I don't, I don't really mind it, that's fine. Uh, <laughs> I was like, whatever. Alright, so over here, this dog ball though should not be in there, so let's actually move that there. We could probably do a door in this hallway. Here. To get to this space, I guess. Actually, oh, that's what I need to do. Is that what I said I was gonna do? I was gonna redo all the paroles and stuff? Because we, we definitely do need to rework some of these, because it's not... It's definitely less than ideal. Um... <laughs> Yeah, look at this building as I was like, dunk, dunk. <laughs> it's nicely in line. All right, well, let's build this. Let's stop jibber-jabbering, and uh, let's get a sweet new cell block here. Well, we also need to build this one, so let's do that. Uh, oh, I built this too big. Uh, oh, no, I didn't. No, 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 I didn't. Okay, no, no, okay, I was worried. Because this actually needs to be a double door, that's why. Okay, that's fine. That goes there, that goes there. Uh, where are my guy? Where are my dudes? Come on, let's get all this done. This area here. And then let's dismantle- oh, hello. Oopsie doopsie. What's happened here? Uh, extremely volatile. He was just murdered by a prisoner with a shank. But why? Is the question. I'm not quite sure. Um, I don't know. Just a bit of fun, I guess. Just a bit of good old- a, a shanking good time. <laughs> uh, that's probably- we shouldn't joke about that. Uh, but I don't know. Probably just should, uh... Okay, can I get the- uh, I'm trying to get the door server. There we go. Dismantle that. Right, let's move that out of the way. Early release. We're getting a good amount of money right now too, by the way. We're actually earning money. Like, we're, our cash flow is low, but we're getting a lot of bonus money from, uh, like, paroles and all that kind of stuff. So, it's actually quite good. Alright, then let's also remove that wall. Because we need to get that out of the way. Eventually. And then we need to rebuild all these walls in. So, let's go here. And then there, and then there, and then there. Oh, that cell needs to go as well. Because that's just going to be a shower block now. So let's remove this one. And then dismantle. All of it. No, no, that one. Oh, no, no, no. There you go. The toilet. And the door. Alright. Cool. This area, please. Let's get all this sorted so we can sort of reconfigure this space nicely. And then we want to go for a wall and demolish this little guy here. And that should give us a nice bit of space to work with over here. So, we want to get our padded flooring, which is going to be here. Did I do it in the doorway as well? I did do it in the doorway as well. So, go in the doorway. And then we're using white tiles through here and through the back. And let's just say do this. Thank you. And we probably want to get another metal detector as well. Because we're kind of missing that at the moment. So, let's get that guy there. And we want to get all of our doors back on. So, all the yellow striped doors. This way, like so. And then we want a nice large one there. And we want our door servo to go there as well. So door... Oh, sorry, what am I doing? Door servo. Oh, we got two of them. Beautiful. That'll go right there. Cool. Alright, so that should sort of hopefully get this this cell block kind of semi back to normal. Uh, we want our showers along the back like that. And then we did our four drains that we do. And then... This kind of the cell block furniture. Let's just get him to get all this under underway. Get that sorted. Get it sorted. Get it sorted. Can you move the box away from the door? Uh, also, let's connect that up before I forget. So, what are we using? We got a new one, don't we? Well, new one that's like still pretty full with controls. Is that one connected? It is. Good. I guess that shouldn't have been a single door. Uh, door there. I was just doing single door because I was copying this one, but it needs to be double. <laughs> so we we'll have to change that as well. All right. So pipes. Uh, nearly go to where they need to. So just do that. Just reconfigure. Should be all good. And get that underway. And then we can get our cell blocks. So, let's go objects. I'm gonna place all the items in first and then we'll, uh, sort it out. Yeah, and you guys are saying, uh, with the roll call thing, the people that sort of come out of their room, they, they take longer to leave their room, are the ones that are potentially tunneling. I don't think it's necessarily 100%, but I think it gives you a way better idea of who is who is doing something I shouldn't be? Now, where is the... 
Why is there like no items in here? I, I'm not. Hello? Why is like TVs and stuff? Uh. Oh. Never mind. I don't know why I couldn't see that. <laughs> anyway, there we go. TVs. Uh, and that's all I've got. I've got TVs and beds and stuff. And and then there was a suggestion as well to add like prayer mats um to their cells because then they can they can use those for spirituality. Which way do we have them facing? Oh, all that way. Let's just do it this way as well. Yeah, nice. Um, so now it's gonna look weird because they're in like just the middle of the room, but it doesn't matter. It's prison architect, so it's fine. We'll give them all this because that will help them with spirituality. So they can still go to the chapel if they want, or they can just go in their room, and that will work too. Uh, so you guys can get them down here, and you and you and you. I think that's all those guys are them. That's good. Whoops. So that will, once we build that up, we'll have a, a nice uh, capacity again, padded cell. So these will go here. And then make sure that is a shower up top. Like so. And we'll get that done. And then that will sort of, uh, will that expand our capacity by one, I think. Because we were like 29, right? Oh no, it would be a bit more than that, actually. Because we, I think we added two more cells, right? Does that get us to 31? I guess that makes sense, yeah, with that one. Okay, cool, so that's that bit done. We've removed that door over here as well, which is nice. Then we need to do another door. Another large door right there. And then we need to go for our metal detectors. See, the only problem with building all this manually, it does take longer, but I guess it's kind of good because we're not actually spending that much money because it is taking me longer to do. So I guess there's that. Now, how do I want to do it? I want to do it like this, yeah. The cell block, cell, whoops, cell block. Well, cell, not cell block, cell. Like so, cell. And those last two there. And that's our showers at the back. Then we get all of these doors in. And this will be a whole another little area for us, which will be fantastic. So now we can go drains, showers. Beautiful, look at this. This is coming together so quick. There's no lights down here though, you may notice, so we probably want to add those in. We'll get a light. Where did I put them in each of the cells? I put them... Well, these... I don't think these have lights. Whoops, I put that in the wrong spot. Because they... they um, we removed them. Uh, I think it almost looks kind of random, so I'm going to actually end up putting them here. Yeah, just one block back from the door. Whoops, from the door, that makes sense. Because that's the spot that we have free. And then we'll get some... Well, we need some in the shower room as well. A couple in the hall. Whoops, that was on top of that. And then a couple down here as well. Okay, cool. So we'll do that, and then we're gonna go flooring, white tiles here, and up. And through here to the back, and along there. And then our padded flooring in the cells. Cool. Then I think maybe, can we clone... Can we clone the furniture at least? Like, can, can I clone that? <laughs> or is that gonna cost me more than it should? This guy doesn't have a light, I don't think, which is good, because I don't want to add lights. Uh... It's gonna cost me $790. Okay, well how much does it cost to just do it myself? So 200, okay, plus 100, so that's $300. All right, then 300 plus a TV is $500, plus a prayer mat is 550, and I think that's it. Is that all the items we have in there? Yeah, so it does actually end up costing a lot more. Hmm. Interesting. They charge a little fee on top of, uh, just for the convenience. Or there's an item I'm missing that I'm not, that I'm not aware of. Interesting. Well, I guess that's good to know. So if we want to save money, just don't use the cloning tool. But I like the cloning tool. <laughs> anyway, let's do this. There you go. All through here. Toilets up the top. And then TVs for each of these guys. Like that. And that should be good. Oh, and you guys. And that should be good. So let's get all that. And I guess that flooring there. All right, and then we got to get the utilities in here because it doesn't look like we actually have power through here. So let's get that and through the back. And danger level's going up. It is the morning. As, you know, as it goes, it's just what happens. Uh, so toilets are at the back, right? Uh, no, they're here, actually, is where toilets are. And here. And then showers are there. Alright, so that should get everything we need. Let's just get them to do all that. Alright, so they, those guys there are showering. This should up our capacity by, what, another eight. I don't know why these cell blocks are smaller than these ones. They just are. So, just don't ask questions about it. It's fine. 
But anyway, this will all get built. That should probably have- Oh, hello. Potential tunnel warning. Uh, there. I guess someone from here could be tunneling down this way. That could make sense. So why don't we have a look, a search of the toilets in here and in here. No, oh, I said and in here. Search these two cell blocks to see if anything's going on. Anything funky. Could also be these guys from over there. Potentially. Or it could just be nothing. I don't know. So let's get that done. Uh, door servo is what I was up to uh, on here, because we kind of need that to be up and running as well. All right, let's get all that going. Uh, beyond that, it looks like we're doing okay. We're getting uh, 12,000 cash flow at the moment, which is nice. So we are getting a little bit of money. Uh, we haven't got around to the classroom yet. We will, we, and we should. I just want to get this in, because this will give us a little bit extra cash. Uh, also, it will increase our capacity, which will be nice. Um, okay. So, I guess actually if I turn these into cell blocks, these doors should hopefully open now too. Uh, hang on, pause, oh, the pause is space bar. Uh, connect that up as well, real quick. So they can at least get in that door easily. I don't think that connected. And I'm not sure why, so let's do that again. Hello? Oh, it's gonna pause. I always forget when you pause it doesn't do it. For some reason. Alright, so that's there. So that, that'll at least be open. And then I think if I make these padded cells, it should um, just open those doors for us. Oh, maybe not till they're completed cells. Mm. Oh no, 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 they're open now. Okay, cool. Alright, then that should, uh, oh look at that! 38, that's so much better. Alright, so then hopefully with some power when they finish the cabling. Dude, you gotta put one, y oh, for some reason they just, they, they just cancel stuff sometimes. I don't understand. You just have to put one cable in it and everything's powered and it's fine. Now, I don't think we found anything here and we haven't got another warning yet, so we'll have to just keep an eye on that. So these, there's no canteens accessible. That's because we haven't deployed it. So we're going to deploy those two areas like that, and then that should be fed by this guy, right? Yeah. Cool. But I don't know that this canteen is going to be really that big enough anymore. We could expand into this space and move the yard over here. Which would probably be a good idea. I don't even think many of them use this yard, so... Well, I mean, there's one guy out here right now. But we could easily move the yard over here. Let's also, um, walls and doors, foundations, walls, uh, let's remove this perimeter wall right there, because that's going to be right in the way of where we're going to be expanding. Alright, so if we can remove this, uh, and then I guess the yard would have to be accessible through this hallway, at least for now. But we'll leave enough space that we could extend the hallway up top. Oh, what was that? Is that guy, just, is that guy running with drugs? <laughs> is that a guard with drugs? Uh, uh, yeah, so then I think, because we're gonna need a bigger canteen, I don't think this will, uh, I mean, you know, it might actually be fine. Um, because we don't have that many, it might be okay, but anyway, we got 39 capacity, we have 24. If we take in another, like, 10, we could probably get away with, uh, and that will give us a bunch of money. So if we say, fill to capacity, well, we don't want to do that, I'm gonna say, uh, number per day, I'm gonna say 10, I'm gonna close that for a second. Open up criminally insane. Oh. Could be a risk though as well. Uh, and then I guess uh, medium security is 106 we have, but we have a capacity for 110, so we could take another four. So if we go medium four like that. So that'll be tomorrow's intake. At least for now, like while we sort of work that out. Okay, that could be cool. So then I do want to move on to uh, doing some more building here. Uh, well, at least moving this and then, because I do, I think we should expand this uh, this area here. Might even, we could even move the kitchen up to the top bit and then have the the chefs go this way and come around. That could be potentially an idea. Uh, I mean, they can still go this way if they want, but... These guys have got a lot of stuff in this metal detector. I don't know, but that's something to consider as well. But yeah, I think for now we should probably move this. We need to, oh, we gotta change this, we gotta change the dog patrol, because... I don't know, it's just not... Not ideal. Hmm. Alright, well, let's build... A wall classy green here. I'm not building it as foundation because foundation because I don't want to. It's just gonna be outside for now. That's fine. Oh. Oh, hello. Oh, that's good. We caught that before it was too late for once. <laughs> I can I don't know if you've noticed, but as this series goes on, I'm less and less surprised by people dying and escaping. It's just like, well, it is what it is. You know, these things are gonna happen. Alright, let's get them to do that. Uh cool. Alright, so we'll do that, and then that wall's gonna go in here. We're gonna have a door here somewhere, but let's not do it yet, because I can access it from there, which is fine. And then this is now gonna become a yard area, and I'm gonna do some barbed wire. 
which I'm actually going to dismantle this barbed wire first, and then we'll sort of move it over. Although, then I wonder if they'll climb out of that area. Oh, probably not. I don't know. We'll see how we go. All right. So then, is that uh, that's being fixed up now? That's good. Good job, guys. Get that fixed so we can get those cells back up and running. Uh, so tomorrow. Oh no! What? 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 Why? Why are you scrolling over here? One of our more charismatic inmates has become something of a religious evangelist. Now they seem to be coming around to their way of thinking. Not necessarily a problem, but our prisoners may soon have more spiritual. Oh, okay. Well, I mean, that's fine. We got we got a chapel. It's don't worry. <laughs> really, not that big of a. Don't worry at me like that, <laughs> dude. Don't don't make me so worried. All right, so that's good. All right, that's good. Up here, we've got that done. So this is going to be, that's barbed wire is gone. We're going to go objects, barbed wire. Now the barbed wire is expensive, but we're going to do this along the top. This is so expensive. Like that. And then on top of this wall. Like that. So that's sort of, inc oh, they can't get any. Oh, I guess because there's no door there. Fair enough. Uh, let me get a door. Oh, is this guy, st oh yeah, they're now stuck in there. Yeah, again, I, God, I gotta, I gotta spend some time. Fixing uh, the all the patrols and everything. Anyway, let's get them to build that. Because that will at least give them access to this area. This guy's just stuck, by the way. This guy's plain out stuck. I don't think there's anything I can do about that. The only thing I can do is say, you're gone. Goodbye. And then just hire a new person over here. Here you go. Welcome. <laughs> That's how we deal with stuck people. So this is now inaccessible. We just have dog balls here randomly. Uh, they're building all this though, which is nice. And then... Let's get a door servo that will just go on that wall right there. And I'm probably going to need some uh, power cable to come up to that. Like that. And then this, not this whole space I don't think, because we'll expand into it a little bit at some point. But for now this area is going to be our yard. And I'm leaving, I specifically have finally left room for a hallway, which I think is good. Um, now how much is it to expand this way? 45,000. Because I want to, we should get protective custody, and it's going to go over here. It's going to go away from everything else. So anyone that's a snitch, or anyone that's anything remotely, that, that should remotely be separated out, they'll go over there. They'll be in their own area. And just away from everybody else. Alright, that's looking pretty good to me. That looks like it's now secured, so let's go deployment. Uh, it's going to be insane sec, insane sec. And that should be fine, and then that's staff only. Okay, so also, um, deployment, patrols. This patrol again has to change. It's getting smaller and smaller every time. There's a dog in that area. We should probably have one over here. I, I don't, I'm gonna be honest, don't know why we don't have that. I just haven't done it yet, I guess. So I'm gonna have a dog that goes... from. I guess I just need to go that far down. Because we just, this is, this patrol is purely for sniffing out tunnels. This is kind of why we have it. So I'm gonna do that. It's also gonna go down these side bits, just because if we can catch the tunnel further down this way, it would be better. Uh, so I'm just gonna do that. It's gonna go down both these way. Whoops. Down like this. And down here. And I guess it would just not do that. Bit. So we're gonna do that. That is now, when are we doing these dog patrols? There's two on that one. There's one on that one. Are they just at all times? Is that what they are? I think they are. Yeah, so we're gonna go to here and say... Oh, uh, assign dog handlers. Oh, oh, hello? Okay. One, two, onto that one. Do we have four assigned to this one? Oh, because there's a blue one that goes in. Okay. Let's see what I've done. I think we need more dog handlers. We can probably get... You know, let's get rid of that one. Because we'll, we'll redo this one anyway. That one's just no good. Uh, let's get rid of that. Alright, get, get that out of there. Alright, so we're gonna have the dog handlers coming up and down the back here as well. And we're definitely going to want to do some flooring, so they can move quicker. Otherwise it's going to take them forever. So concrete tiles, I guess we'll have to go here. And just so it looks good, we'll leave a gap between them all, like that. I might actually have to <laughs> replan the thing I just did. I guess I'll go there, because that one, other ones are there. But then down the middle they'll go like that, because it just needs to fill the whole spot. Like that. Like this. Like that. And that's good. Alright, so let's have a look at the deployment now again, because I'm going to have to change it. Because uh, it's going to have to go here, where the concrete tiles actually are, and that's going to have to go a little bit further out to there. And then we've got to remove all of this bit, because there's not going to be any flooring there. There you go. It's going to go there. It's going to go there. And these two are actually going to go in the middle. And does that mean I'm going to under... <sighs> the deployments are gone now. So whatever. 
They're gonna go there, and then that's gonna go here. Okay. That should be fine. That should be exactly where it needs to be. Now, let's also get- whoops. Move uh, some dog handlers back onto this one, too. And that should be at all times, which is good. So hopefully that actually assigns someone- I don't think we have enough dog handlers, because you can quite clearly see there's a bunch of empty assignments right now. We have one, two, three, four, five, six active dogs. But then a bunch of inactive ones, too, so... I'm thinking we need more of these, because they're very tired. And maybe we need more bowls around- oh, they have a bunch of them here. It does help them out. Maybe we need some more. Hmm. I just don't have- we don't- our cash flow is not that high. Uh, I guess we could repay- if we wanted to, we could repay some of the loan. Although, actually... Yeah, we just- yeah, okay, I gotta turn the intake off. I gotta- I gotta turn that off. No more criminally insane. Field of capacity on these guys. Alright. Yeah, no more criminally insane, because that'll overwhelm us if we get more. <laughs> we just got a bunch of them. We got a nice payment, though. That's really good. Uh, yeah, here they are. That's good. We got $49,000. Uh, okay, so then what we're gonna want to do... Uh, I guess I'll wait for... That, that'll sort of sort itself out. How many... So how many dog handlers do we actually have? We've got... Um, I don't... Hello, dog handlers. Why can't I see them? Oh, it's there. 15. I think I have s oh, we had six active, but we had 15 of them. I guess we just need more. It's just the prison's so big, I guess. Gotta be careful of our actual mana. All right, there you go. All right, so they'll, they'll go off and do so. Okay, that, that might be better. That might help us out. So we've actually got a few more. So then we'll have them patrolling up and down this new pathway. A bunch of money for an early release there as well, which is very nice. Okay, cool. So let's also connect that up uh, to our servo system. There you go. We're gonna deployment. We're gonna make that staff only now. Uh, do we actually have guards deployed in there, or are they just hanging out? I think they're just hanging out. Yeah, because it's a yard. All right, that's no longer gonna be a yard. We're gonna remove all that. We're gonna move that stuff over here. We're gonna have to redo some of this as well. So concrete tiles. We'll do the concrete tiles around the side. I was. I always do like it sort of surrounding the area. It's gonna be this whole area now, so they get a bigger yard and grass in the middle, like that. Uh, so they currently have to come around the top, which I guess is fine. And then, uh, yeah, because we'll keep all this area staff only until it's done. So right now they don't have a yard. Which is fine. But we're gonna work on that. And then we're gonna get this guy to go here. Just so we have a wall between these two, because we'll turn this into an interior area. And there'll be just a bigger canteen. Alright, so they're gonna get on with that. This is all built. I don't see any dogs patrolling there though, so that's that, I guess. Anyway, these guys are here, which is nice, getting the grass in. We're gonna start moving this stuff over as well. Um, we'll probably add an access from- because this will be canteen, we'll probably have an access to the yard here as well. But I'm gonna move this here, I'm gonna move the dog bowls somewhere, and you know, I probably should have just dismantled it. I don't know why I put it there. We'll move it into storage, because we don't need those there anymore. And then we're gonna move- well, where's where I moving the other one? I don't know where I put it now. And also put that in storage as well. Whoops, don't follow it. Put it in storage. Okay, so those are gonna go away. Are they gonna move this? Oh yeah, they did. Oh, they already did it. Right, okay, sorry. <laughs> We've already done it, okay. Guys, you're so efficient, you gotta wait for me. Wait for me, guys. Alright, so I don't even know if these, they're, they're using these. Like, I don't think I've seen them use it, but whatever. Uh, then we'll get the exercise equipment. Maybe that'll go in the middle here instead of on the edge, because it doesn't need to go on the edge anymore. Nice little area like this, four of them there. Some benches. Uh, I guess the problem with this now is that they can have stuff thrown over the wall to them. So we probably want to sort that out at some point. You know, but that's fine. We'll, we'll let him, we'll let him enjoy that, that luxury at the moment of people potentially throwing supplies over the wall. Look, not ideal, but um, Hello, hello. So well, this is why we have dogs in this area. So let's search those two cell blocks. So it looks like there's something fishy going on there. Alright, those are gonna move over. That should be good. That area will be cleared out. And then I will add- I'm gonna add another door. Yep, there's definitely something going on over there. I'm gonna add another door here. Uh, and then we'll do another door. Well, not yet. We won't put it there yet. So then this will provide access to the, uh, the yard. I'm actually just gonna lock it open, because I'm, I'm not gonna bother putting a, uh, door survey on it. And someone's got a rope. Looks like you, my friend, might have been trying to get out. Uh, I actually kinda wanna dismantle this toilet right now, because 
If he had a rope, he might be... I don't know, actually, why would he be digging if he had a rope, though? No, you know what? He might not have been. He might be fine. It might be someone else. But he definitely still shouldn't have a rope. That's all. Well, you, hang on. Looks like you, my friend. Oh, you were digging! Hey, look like this one was, because I had a pickaxe. Um, although, I don't know that you were, because if you were, you've only just started, and you haven't gone there, which is interesting. But we'll check that one, too. Uh, you did have a pickaxe, though, so... I, I'm gonna be honest, I don't know how they're getting pickaxes through here, because they're freaking huge. Like, how are you managing to do that? Uh, that guy didn't have anything. Let's put those back. Get all that done. Uh, good job, dogs! You've saved the day! Uh, and let's get those done. And get those done. Alright, cool. So that should get that all built. This area up here is now gonna be the yards of deployment is insane, insane, all there. And then the rooms, uh, that will be our yard. Through here. Now, it was annoying me that the, for some reason there's not one- There's one piece of barbed wire just sitting there that isn't placed. I, I'm not quite sure why. Oh, it is actually scheduled to be placed, it just is- Oh, did I just do that? Maybe I did it before. I don't know, it's just not placed yet. Oh. Is it because you guys are for some reason stuck here? I'm not actually sure what's going on with that. Huh. That's odd. Alright, you're gone. And then we'll get another one. Maybe you can do it? Okay, you're gonna go that way? Alright, fine. <laughs> Yeah, I, I don't know. I didn't know... Can I... No, I, don't, I don't know why they were stuck there. That was that was weird. Anyway, I'm glad I didn't notice that. <laughs> so that's fixed. That's now their yard. We've got an orderly just going out to hang that. Oh no, they're just walking through to the other side. Alright. Um, okay, so that's good. We've got now 141 out of 148. We've got 34 criminally insane out of 39. We still don't have a classroom, so we're gonna do that. Um, I don't know. Do we need to make this canteen bigger? Is that something we had to do? Was that on the agenda? Let's see. So we've got eight on each table. How many tables do we have? Uh, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. Uh, so what's that? That's 96. And we've got 107. So we actually don't have enough space in here. So yeah, the other the suggestion was to just sort of shift up some of this stuff along. So maybe we'll build this a little bit bigger. Uh, hang on, main. Build brick. That'll go here. To that point. We have 50 grand. That's pretty good. I'm pretty happy with this. Like, considering we're also paying off a loan. Uh, that's pretty good. Where, where is it? It's in here. Current bank loan, 178. And what can, we can have up to 250,000 now, because we've got a credit rating of 10. Damn right we do. Alright, so then, um, I mean, we could decrease this a bit if we wanted, so we're spending a little less per day. It doesn't need to be that high anymore. Um, there you go. Let's we'll do the one, because I guess I couldn't do both the one anyway. I've got to decrease it by... How much is it? It doesn't say how much it costs to decrease it. I think it's getting cut off at the bottom. Hang on. Wait, no it's not. It doesn't you do, no, it just doesn't say how much you pay. <laughs> okay, cool. Great. Alright, whatever. Anyway, so we're gonna build that. We'll sort of shift a couple of these things along here. Probably move that wall as well. And then the canteen could be a little bit bigger, which would be nice. Oh, shop sales commission. Sweet. So that'll be good. Oh, hello. Are we already back to more tunnels here? Alright, search cell block. Search cell block. Although I guess it was here, wasn't it? So there might be one <laughs> what's here as well. Hey guys, we're back again. We gotta check this out, because something something fishy's going on. Alright, so let's move, I guess, this door. I'm gonna move it to here, so it's just in line with that. And then that wall. What did I what is that concrete? Why am I using so many different walls? I, I'm gonna be honest, no idea why. I'm gonna use a tiled wall there so it matches that, and I'll use a brick wall here so it matches that. So let's do this. Come on. And then oh, why is this not connected? Uh, it's not. Huh. Well, we're gonna move it anyway, so I guess let's not worry about it. So I had that as like a four wide, so one, two, three, four. We could do it like this. Then how big is this area? This is 11 by 14, which is more than big enough, I reckon. So that's gonna be 11 by 14. So it's gonna be here. Like that. And then this gives us all this space here for the canteen. All right. So let's do that. So let's wait till I move that door. Uh, eventually. Oh, actually, we're not moving that door, are we? No, never mind. We get, we actually got to get rid of that door because it's kind of in the way. Uh, dismantle that as well. Because yeah, we need a single door there instead. But just fine. You know, it's fine. It's a little bit different. It's all different, but it's gonna work out. So jail door there. Uh, then we're gonna go double jail door 
here somewhere. I guess about there-ish. Oh, I guess I didn't need to use that one, but we'll move that. And then we're gonna move all that stuff over there. So we're gonna go rooms, uh, cleaning cupboard. Get rid of that. That's gonna go here. And then we're gonna go for laundry. And go here. Remove that. And then that'll go here. These just go down here. I wonder if we need to increase the laundry now. Like, do we need more stuff? I've not really been paying attention to any of that, so... <laughs> I've just been assuming it's fine. There hasn't been any... I mean, I don't think there's been any major problems. So, whatever, I guess, right? Anyway, and then all these uniforms and those things should just move during the day. Because I don't think I can move these, because they, they've been moved, so it's not really letting me uh, move them. They will just come and do that themselves. It, oh, hello. Uh, potential tunnel here. I don't know why you dig here, though. Because anyone digging out of any of these toilets would go up and along. Like, they'd go like that. Oh, unless it's quicker to go this way for them. Maybe they're coming out and down. But then, I don't know, it seems like a very... I mean, maybe, I guess... It's probably quicker than going that way, isn't it? Okay, okay, it's potential. We'll keep an eye on that. I don't know, also don't know why we're missing a single tile here. But we are. So let's put that in. <laughs> I don't know where that's gone. Alright, so move all that over there. They're getting there. I guess this door can also be removed. Dismantle. We should- oh we, can, oh, we can move the canteen door so it lines up with this pathway. That'll be nice. Let's dismantle this and- and the door servo. And these. I said and... these. It's gonna be so good. Reconfigure all that. Alright, so let's move it out of that way. Let's get out our, uh, cave- oh, that actually already lines up. That's really good. That's actually so handy. <laughs> and then this is gonna go down to there. Get them to build that, please. And then we probably should get a wall back here, because it's going to be opening. And then we can dismantle or demolish these walls. And deployment, that should... Nope, that should be staff only. <laughs> medium security, medium security, medium security. Good. Alright, that's staff only. That's how it should be. <laughs> Hopefully. Alright, so then this... This is a big... This is a bit of a security hole right here. Like, uh, anyone can just walk up and throw something over the wall, so that's a thing. But, you know, we'll work on that, you know. Uh, little by little. Yeah, it's just a little step we gotta do. Now, moving all of this, did we have deployments in these areas? We might have. I'm, I'm not sure. We probably did, but they're gonna be gone now, I think. There's no patrols. Deployments. So is, what, wait, what is work hours? Which are work hours? Uh, programs. Nope. Uh, regime. Work hours is 10, so it's the red. Uh, yeah, there was someone in here, so they're actually gonna be moved now. Uh, so let's go... Put them in these two rooms. They should be in those two. Uh, not in here, because that's just a canteen. We already have one. We'll probably get maybe two in the canteen. Well, we had we, had, we had an armed guard in the canteen at that time. Dang. When it's eight time, we got an armed guard. <laughs> okay. Well, I guess. To be sure I'm. Uh, <laughs> I don't know why. Oh, we probably had to deploy them like eight. I like how everyone's going through here now, because there's no metal detector. So like, sweet. <laughs> let's, uh, let's cap that off. And that bit. Actually, no, I don't I don't know why I did that bit. I'll do that bit to this bit. And then let's demolish this and this. Okay. So at least for now they will have to go through that one on the way out. Uh, that was a bit of a hole. Alright, so then we're gonna large our door here. Nope. It's the other way around. Here. And then a door servo. Uh to accompany that. Like so. And then a couple of metal detectors. Oops. Metal detector. There and there. Get all that built. Thank you. Alright, so that'll go in there. All these guys are going to have to squeeze out that door, so that's a whole thing, but that's fine. They eventually got out, so there's that. And then this will be put in, and then we can connect it up to, I guess, to this one. There, do we need to do these ones? Probably. That one there. And then we also need one on this door too, which we don't currently have. And then we're going to need some cables run into that room, so get that on. Get these done. There we go. Beautiful. And then we'll expand this room out a little bit in a minute. So there. These guys are doing a great job cleaning. I'm very proud of you. Probably should have a wall there. Oh. Hello. Oh. Who's, uh... Wait, I don't even... Who's died? You've died. Wait, what are you doing in there? Overdose. Oh, okay. You, oh, okay, that's fine. I thought it was a criminal insane. No, no, no. This is someone overdosing. I mean, that's not a good thing, but, like... At least it wasn't the criminally insane. That, that'd be worse. Alright, so let's remove this wall. 
and this wall. And that will sort of combine these spaces back together, which would be nice. We've got the cleaning cupboard and the laundry now. They're actually looking surprisingly clean, I guess because we only just built them. Everything every, everywhere else in the prison looks pretty dirty. So canteen. I need to expand this out to there, and I guess to this bit too, and then we'll do the rest in a minute. There we go. There. Ah, oh, six grand. Beautiful. Cool. All right, then we can just do some more tables because we got, what, 96 at the moment. So if we go table uh, there, that'll add uh, 100, 104, 108, and 112. And then that's more than enough right now because we've got 110 capacity. So that'll be fine for now. Uh, the room is bigger than it needs to be, but that's fine. That'll go through there. They'll get all that built. And then I want to get this classroom done. But I, where should it go? Uh, well, so definitely need to expand this. How big is this one? How, what? Oh, someone's got a drill. Dang. Um, how big is this? So we got, what, 2, 4, 6, 8, 10, 12, 14, 16, 18, 20, 22, 24. Yeah, that's not enough if we got a capacity of 40. So let's build out this area. <laughs> it's definitely not enough. Build out this area. I guess, can I just fill the middle? Because it's not going to build a wall, is it? I'll build it that way because it might, I think it'll demolish that wall. And can just combine into this area, which is fine. And then we can rework the rest of it in a minute. All right, so they'll build that. So then we can at least expand this canteen, which is far, far too small for the amount of criminally insane that we have. So that'll go in. Are they going to remove those lights or are they just going to leave those floodlights in here? Uh, let's see. Alright, so that wall is gone. We're going to move this door over here. We're going to move that servo over here. Like that. So this is now going to be part of the canteen. Uh, and then the question is, do we move the kitchen at the same time? Like, is that up to here? It probably- oh! Hang on. Bit of an altercation. Hello? Oh, it's a bit of a skerfuffle. Armed guards too. Well, where are they? Are they just hanging out over here doing nothing? Probably don't- <laughs> Probably should just fire my armed guards. Where are they? How do I find them? Like, is there a way I can find them? I swear they're- Oh, yeah, if you go, uh... Staff. Here we go. This will help. You one there and one here. Alright, let's just fire these two guys. We, we, we really don't need armed guards. <laughs> It'll also save us a bunch of money. Alright, anyway, let's get rid of those. No free fire. All gone. <laughs> Oh god, alright. Did have a bit of a, you know, a bit of a scuffle, but that's gonna happen. You know, it is a prison after all these things happen. There's only so much you can do about it. Alright, classy wall is gonna go there. Build all that, please. I'm gonna block off this hallway, I guess, that's going here. Sure. Yeah, that'll be fine. We're gonna, we're gonna add a door back in if we want. Um, if we're gonna do a kitchen at the top, I don't think it needs to be quite this big. So if we go two, four, well, one, two, three, four, five things there. Then we could have cookers all the way along here, and then things on the bottom too. Like, there's plenty of room for stuff here. We could do a couple sinks there. Like, that would be a good sized kitchen. We could make it a bit smaller. Because I don't think it needs to be that big. For this, no, that's that's huge. We could probably even just go... Just to this size. Like that. Have a sink there. Whoops. And then probably fit another sink right there if we wanted. Yeah, that'll be a good. I think that's a good size. Let's do that. So we're going to go for a wall here. And then I'm going to move. Because we don't have breakfast till the morning. Well, the next food till the morning. So we're going to move this stuff. The fridge. There. Fridge. Whoops, that's a light. No. Fri fridge. There. Fridge. There. Here we go. Yeah, yeah this will work. I reckon this will be good. Oh, wait, I didn't consider... Okay, we're just going to rotate them. <laughs> I didn't consider if I'm putting a wall there, I can't have them facing the wall. It's okay, we can do it like this. Uh, yeah, that's good. So that's those three... Four... Five... And six. And we can get a couple more if we want, which we might as well expand while we're at it. Uh, so let's go kitchen. Uh, kitchen, there we go. Get another two, maybe. Like that. And we get, so one, two, three, and then just four. Because then we have one fridge for each cooker. Get another sink right there. We actually have another room. We have another little bit of room that we could use if we wanted. So we could expand even more, but I think we'll just leave that. Do we have any bins in there? I do. 
Uh, yes, we should definitely do sprinklers up there. They're currently all dotted around this kitchen, which I guess we're going to have to move because that doesn't really make sense anymore. So maybe I'll just double click these and move them. And one there. One there. There. So these all go in the kitchen. Like this. I don't know which ones I've moved. I'm very confused now. So let's just... <laughs> Let's let them do this and then figure it out. All right, so then I'm going to move this door. I am going to have one here. So it'll just like line up with this little hallway in there. So if they are coming from this way, they can. Because we may as well. So then if they also, that means if they're going from here out to there, they can just walk through the canteen. I don't have a problem with that. I think that'll be fine. Let's go rooms, uh, kitchen. We're going to remove this one. Place it up here. And we're definitely going to want to get this power out to up this area here. Like that. And then we'll figure out all the plumbing in a second as well. Just probably want to get the lighting up there. And then walls, we're going to go ahead and remove all these interior ones here. Move this door maybe to there, just so it lines up with that one. That makes sense. And then we can remove this wall there. There you go. Look at that. Beautiful. And then we should probably remove this stuff there too. That doesn't make any sense anymore. We'll dismantle that. And then that should be a wall. Right about there. Cool. Alright, so the kitchen should be, you know, somewhat functional. Um, which should be good. So hopefully the chefs will go over there. I don't know what's happened to the chefs. And slash if they've just moved to this one. Or if they've just gone to the other kitchen. Because I'm not seeing a lot of activity up there right now. <laughs> at all. So I don't know what's happened to them. Let's have a look uh, at everyone. So we've got staff over here. Okay. Looks like we got a bunch. Oh, hang on. Actually, you're in this one. Okay, here we go. Oh, yeah, there's a few in here. Okay, cool. Uh, <laughs> all right, cool. The so flooring, I guess we're doing... Are we doing padded in all of this? <sighs> Maybe not. <laughs> so expensive. Yeah, that's cheaper. No padded. There we go. And up in the kitchen as well. All right, then we need, definitely need more lights in here. And we also need... Uh, whoops. Maybe the serving table up the top. To there. Maybe more of these sprinklers. There, there, there. I think that should be hopefully pretty protective of these things if they blow up and cause a fire. Especially because these ones are quite close now to the exterior wall. Like if we had a fire rip through here, that would just create a huge hole in the side of the prison. Which could be a potential issue. So anyway, let's get them to move that and see how many we've got left after that. Uh, can we get the... Why is there no power? Oh, there is power. We just don't have any lights in there. That's a slight issue. Do you guys want to add, like, lights to this room? <laughs> that would probably help, too. There you go. Now they can see. That's better. All right, so then hopefully they can serve. Oh, hello. Hello, hello. Down over here? Okay, well, we should probably definitely search these cell blocks. And these ones. Uh, if someone's that close to getting out, we should probably look. Uh, someone's got a pickaxe there, so let's uh, dismantle that toilet. Have a look. And we're still searching that one. Hmm. Get a pickaxe in the toilet, which is probably... That's probably where you're going to be using that. No, interestingly not. Okay. Well, I don't trust that there's not something going on in here, so we're going to dismantle these toilets. All along here. Like that, and just have a look real quick. Hmm. Interesting. Okay. No one here was being bad. Well, that doesn't... Well, I mean, one of them had a pickaxe, so that's not ideal. Alright, put this back, please. Right now. Oh, okay. Uh, yeah, we really... Uh, yep, snitch. We really need to get onto protective custody. I know I've been saying that so long, but honestly, there's just so many little jobs that we need to do. That, I mean, oh god, these pipes. Can I Can I clear these out a little bit? Uh, can I clear out? Oh, I, I can't click and drag. I want to clear out all this because this is just a mess. This is the old kitchen doesn't need to be here anymore. So it's just I know it's going to remove. Whoops, I think I just killed the big pipe. I know it's going to remove some of the other connections here, but it's for the best. It's honestly for the best. So let's just do that. <laughs> there you go. Let's clean that up and then we'll just have to put it back in where I've cut it off. There you go. Put that back and that one right now, like right now. And power is still here. We're just going to get this one back in. Okay. There you go. That should be fine. No, no. Okay. And that one. And that one. And that one. 
<laughs> okay. And then, are they still getting rid of this one? No, I don't think so for some reason. These are still here. I don't know why these didn't get removed. Or well, that one. Alright, cool. That should be nice. At least it looks cleaner now in this view. Not that it matters. I guess we could have just left it there. But it just, you know, not very nice. Alright, we're going to need a big pipe to come up here a little bit. Just so it can actually reach all through here. So we're going to go like that through the middle. Up to here, along the top for all of those. Hopefully this will get to all of them. But, you know, only one way to find out. Alright, so let's get all that done. Uh, I don't know, did I connect this guy? I don't think I did. So let's get, uh, which is the top one? Is this the top one? This one. And to that one there too. And that's still connected. Cool. Alright, so let's go deployment. Uh, insane sec. There you go. Insane sec. This should be, all be fine. And that should definitely still be stuff only. Stuff only. Fantastic. So this is now their canteen, which is looking a little sad because there's just tiny tables on this end of the room for some reason. So I have all these extra sprinklers, which I guess I might just dismantle. Because I don't think we really need them there. And they're not connected to anything. Oh, I guess that one is now. So, you know, I'll leave it. Whatever. All right, so that's there. Let's get all that built and get those guys plumbed in. And then let's go objects uh, serving... Whoops. We've got 41,000. I think we're, it's good. We're actually doing pretty decently with money at the moment. Uh, so I'm quite happy with that now. Table. Let's go. How can we fit these in like this? Uh, actually, I want to make sure we leave a little bit of a gap for the walkway there. Oh, and that door's there. Yeah, these doors are not really aligned. I mean, you know, we don't really need to. It was just, it's just for aesthetics, mostly. Alright, so how many do we need? We need like 40, 40 seats or something? Yeah, 40. So we got, what, 8, 16. This will be 32. Probably just want another table down here. If we just dismount... Oh, hello. Alright, let's go search some cell blocks here. I just found that twice. Let's search that one. We didn't find anything down there. Could be these guys, so I don't know. We'll have to do, we'll just, should do another full shakedown soon as well. All right, so let's uh, speed up a little bit of time here. We're earning 15,000. Maybe I'll actually go back into here and go to um, finance, note, grants, uh, decrease a little bit. Another 25,000 down, down to 128, only 6,400 a day. Oh, look at that income. Uh, get that down a little bit. That'll be nice. That'll help us. So, actually, how where are we at on this? To 200. So, if we get another 50 uh, capacity, we'll get a bunch of money. Which is nice. Alright, so I do want to go here and dismantle these tables. Uh, these small ones. I like the small ones because they're new and I've not seen them before. But, it is time that they go. Because they are too small. Let's get those out of there. Uh, there's also no lights on this half of the room. So, let's maybe get some lights up here. <laughs> there you go. Half the room is dark, so let's get that done. Uh, we do have some windows as well. I, I don't ever use windows in this game. But you know what? I'm going to give these guys some windows right there. You can look out. Nice. Beautiful. There you go. And they're all coming in. We don't have any metal detectors directly onto the canteen. But a clipboard? What's wrong with a clipboard? We found a clipboard? Alright. I don't know what that even means. I guess I could check. <laughs> I know there is like a whole thing here. I just don't... <laughs> Usually don't care about it that much. Although, hang on. Uh, stolen from. Okay, there's a bunch of ropes. Man, so many people stealing all these things. Um, seven days. Okay, here we go. Clipboard. What, what's so bad about a clipboard, though? I don't know. What even is it? <laughs> it's been taken all over the place. Jeez. Smuggled by prisoner 101 hours ago. Jesus. So, wait, wait is this where it started? Here? Is that the start? It's very hard to follow this. It was hidden in here for a while, in the toilet. But I'm not even sure what this is. Booze, narcotics, tools? Because uh, it's- well, I know it's a clipboard, obviously, but like, what, what category is that? Cell phone? Uh, no. Tools? Weapon? It's not a weapon, it's a clipboard. I don't know what this is! <laughs> what does it do? Hmm. I don't know. You'll let me know in the comments. Thanks, guys. I appreciate it. Oh, that was a good comment. I really appreciate that. That I assume you just commented. All right, let's get another table in here. Small... No, not small bench. I mean, you could... Actually, you could do two small benches, surely. Would that work? I'm not going to, but let's just do that. All right, so that should have enough stuff for them now. Um, are they going to move that stuff to storage, or are we out of room in storage? we got a lot of random junk in here now. we got a lot of small uh, benches and stuff, which I guess we're just going to dump. Because... Uh, 
We're never going to use the small tables anymore. They're just taking up space, so it's a shame, but... You know, whatever. There you go. Let's clean some room out in here. Box. Dump. Alright, well, actually, let's just leave that for a second. So, classroom. I do want a classroom. We are definitely running out of room in what we've got here. And I do want to go this way, which alone is going to cost 45 grand. But I want a classroom because I want to start doing this. But where do we put it? We could probably slice off a bit of this canteen and do it here for now. And then maybe we'll have to move it later. So maybe we'll do that. We'll go here. I mean, at the moment, this is just a waste of space, so we might as well. Uh, and then that can just be probably just a regular door. Oh, chest of drawers. Dang. Look at this. That's fancy. Well, I don't know what I'm going to do with that, but it's cool. Right, classroom. There you go. Uh, walls and doors. We'll just get a beautiful... Oh, look at that wall. We get a beautiful door. Well, I might as well use, use a jail door. We've got two of them in storage anyway. Put it there. Whatever. And then door servo. Oh, I don't know where it is. Hang on. It's here. In this spot. Yeah. And uh, that's going to go there. And then, oh, let's fix all these, these tiles as well. Yeah, yeah. I, I, now, I, I said, because I promised that we were going to do the classroom, so we're going to do the damn classroom. And then in between, we'll do grass, because we, let's, you know, make this place look nice again. It's been a while since it's looked nice and pretty, so let's get that looking good again. There you go. Yeah. Nice. Look at this. We could even do some lights in these areas. Let's do some outdoor lights. Wouldn't that be special? I'm just going to do that for now. I don't want to do it anymore. <laughs> Alright, so we're going to do that. Alright, so the classroom needs a school desk and an office desk. I think there's, what, a maximum of 20 per class. So that's kind of all we need. Or at least that's what it used to be. I don't know if that's still the case. So we're going to do a, a nice teacher's desk here. And school desks. Uh, one, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four, five. I guess we could do them closer, actually. One, two, three, four, five. Because I don't need to count them every time. Because then that is 20. Easy done. Now, I don't think they need anything else. I guess we could do class. Is there anything decorative we could do? Oh, classy window. Hell yeah, we need a classy window for the classroom. How could the classy, <laughs> how could the classroom not have a classy window? Uh, do we need power here? Probably. Oh no, actually it was connected anyway. We didn't need to do that. That's fine. Who cares? Alright, let's connect that up as well to our servos. Maybe to the newer one that has a little less on it. Oh. I don't think I clicked on it. Oh, that was tidy wires. Whoops. Hello? Why is it not? Oh, yeah. Are these connected? Yeah, I connected these. Yeah, cool. That one's not connected actually, so let's connect that one and that one. That is, that is. I don't, if I've missed any, I'm sure you guys will tell me anyway, so it should be fine. All right, so let's go to deployment. That'll be medium security. I don't think I need to deploy these, but I will. Let's make sure that's still stuff only out there. Cool. Cool. All right, so we've got the classroom. Looking good. Looking fantastic. Let's go over to here. Um, let's go programs. Let's go down to ones we don't have yet. Foundation. Oh, 56 interested. Look at that. Oh. Okay, well, we can't do any more than that. That's pretty good. That's a good class fill rate. So 10 to 4. So I think it's during work hours, right? Uh, pro, no, uh, regime. 10 to 4. Yeah, so if we probably want to deploy some dudes in there during that time. So let's have a look. So work hours. We'll sign a guard in there. Let's just get someone in there during work hours. Probably a good idea. All right, cool. So that will have classes running. So we've finally done the classroom. Should we do some flooring? We got a little bit of money. Let's do a nice... Oh, hello. There's something, there's something going on. There's something fishy. Let's do a full shakedown. No, it's 5 a.m. Not a great time to do it. But we'll do it anyway. Oh, there it is. Great. We could... Uh, you know what? I'm going to cancel that shakedown. That's it for now. We'll do another... We'll, we'll have to, we should do them at night time. So they're all in their cells anyway. So let's get that done. Uh, at least we found this one. Uh, would have taken them a while. They'd probably still have a bit more time before they get out, but... These ones here are much more worried about right on the edge. Uh, maybe if we get enough money to get this built, or not built, this purchased, that'd be great. Because I think we'll purchase this land and then maybe this one. Because these will both be the same price, right? They should be both 45. And then this one will be way more expensive because once we expand the length, you have to buy like the whole thing. 
So it starts getting really expensive, but um, we'll maybe do that. I want to see this class. I want to see this class running though. Here we go. Yeah. Cool. There's no guard in here yet though. We should probably. Uh, hello. Do we not have enough guards? There's someone assigned to it, but they're not here. We might need to assign them like the hour before, so they're actually there in time. Although these guys seem pretty good, so you know, not a bad thing. Not a bad thing at all. I think we might need more chefs because this place is really, really dirty. With more cooks. Two more there. Do we need more up here? One more up there. We also need more janitors. No janitors in this place. Let's also dismantle these sprinklers. There we go. This place is just so dirty. I think I just the light, not the uh, sprinkler. Oh no, maybe, maybe it was fine. Okay, cool. All right, cool. That's better. This is so yeah, it's so disgusting. This whole this whole prison is getting really mank. Um, we probably have enough to just hire more janitors, but we should probably also just get more people in the cleaning cupboard or get more cleaning cupboards. Because how many do we have in there? Max jobs. Oh, I haven't assigned them. No, oh, that's probably why. Because when we moved the rooms, I didn't assign them. Noob. Right, there we go. Let's just sign over into these. There you go. That's better. All right, get the laundry crew back together. There we go. Get the prisoners cleaning the prison again because it's really disgustingly dirty. Oh. All right. <laughs> All right. <laughs> we got a tunnel here potentially. Okay. Okay. Search toilets in there, please, and maybe these ones as well. Hmm. Nothing there, okay. Could be these guys over here as well. It's not necessarily just these ones. Oh dear. Alright, well that's looking pretty good. We, we did get the classroom done in the end, which I'm quite happy with. <laughs> it only took the entire episode. Oh, look at those classy windows with the curtains on them. Very nice. Um, Alright, let's get... um. Do I want to do some flooring? We should probably do some flooring. Let's, just, let's finish up with the flooring. White tiles in the, the kitchen and all that. Kitchen and canteen. White tiles, there you go. It's a bit of money. It's a bit expensive. Wooden floorboards in here, though. Very nice. Again, a bit expensive. Laundry. White tiles. White tiles. I don't know. I feel like, it feels like so blank and bland. Same with all of this. Like, I do I do like this nice hallway. Mm, nice. It's kind of weird here, though. Which, oh, hello. Is that, a, is that an issue of uh, protective custody not existing? I can't see who died. Everyone's in the way. Excuse me. Excuse me. Being a snitch. Yep, we definitely need protective custody. <laughs> All right, let's get. Uh, no, you know what? Let's not. Let's not wait because that's. Let's let's just get because it's gonna take too long. Let's just do this. There you go. And then let's do this. Thank you. Whoa. Oh, so oh, look at that big lake. Let me also just save because that kind of scared me. Psych thirteen. There we go. All right. So, we got all this space over here. We're going to build protective custody over here. Maybe something else, I don't know, but definitely protective custody will be over this side of the entire map. Then, we're going to want to build this, or build, buy that. Then, we're going to want to buy the top, which is now more expensive because you have to buy a bigger plot of land. Well, yeah, we have a lot more land now to build out next time. That's great. So, leave your comments, suggestions, and feedback down below. I'll see you next time, and have an awesome day.